to the joy of painting with me, Michael Farley. Now, I'm just going to have the guys just scan the colors you're going to need today, right there, uh, across the screen. And we're just going to dive straight in. Now, I've got a typical A3 blank canvas at home. Go bigger or smaller. It's, it's highly up to you. And we're just going to dive straight into our world. First, we're going to take our, our little two inch brush here. And, we're just gonna dive straight in. Okay, now we're gonna start with just a little, I love water. I don't know if, if I've ever said this before, but I, I just love being in water. It's just great for all the reflections and fun. Just getting in there and we're gonna have a nice little pond here in the, the bottom corner. All those little critters love to come down and get in there and just play in the pond. It's just great. now. Next, I'm going to move to some kind of trees, okay? You know, I'm going to take my one inch brush and I'm going to start up here and I'm just going to, just going to speckle. I'm just going to speckle my trees. Now, you can put these trees wherever you like. It's, it's entirely up to you. This is, this is your world. You're in charge, okay? So, I'm going to give myself a, a nice little tree here. Just, just a little, a little dab like that. Just Again, I'm gonna maybe gonna just again just tiny little strokes just down here just to give the impression of almost like a like a grass. Just there we go. Now again, it's, it's entirely up to you. And you can see this this is so simple. This strategy, just just take it up, just take it up right there. There we go, there we go. Okay, now we're gonna take another another one inch brush and just gonna, just gonna bring a trunk down here. Just, just a nice little, nice little trunk there. Just give the idea of a, a lovely woodland. You can make the, it as big or as, as little as you like. It's your world. It's entirely up to you how you want to paint it. Okay, now I'm gonna take my, my small brush and I want to paint me a house to live in. Okay, now. Do you ever dream of having a nice house in the woods? Well, now's your time. Now's your time. There we go. So I'm just gonna, just gonna just paint my, my house there. Just, just somewhere for me to live and watch the ducks on the pond. Just, just frolicking and just having a great little duck life. And there we go. Just gonna cover that in. Without cleaning your brush, you're gonna take another brush. We're just gonna add, mm -hmm. add some windows. Just you know, just make it nice and simple. It's your house. It's, it's how you want to live. It's it's that house that you've always dreamed of. There we go. Put that one down there. Okay, and then we're gonna cover the rest of the house in. And as you can see, it's just that easy, just to get some really kind of sophisticated technical looks just from what is a very simple, simple picture. Now I'm gonna go back to our to our two-inch green brush because like I said, this is like a it's like a forest scene, okay? So all those critters gonna need somewhere to live. So we're just gonna add just some trees just above the just above the house, make that house feel all nice and warm and secure. Again, just that dab, dabbling effect. Just to, don't forget that this is this is your house and and your world. It's however you want it to be. Okay, now I'm gonna now this next one's quite a quite a complicated technique. We're gonna add a little bit of a little bit of light just to kind of make it feel like the sun's kind of poking in between the trees like a like a shaft of light on a, on a cool winter's morning okay so just just a little bit of sunlight just a little bit of sunlight just coming in through through the trees there you can just just the idea of sunlight now we're going to take another one inch brush and we're going to have, there's no point in having a house if you can't get to it or you know, so we're just going to add a bit of a bit of a path, just just through the woodland, around the pond, just so you can 
You can, there's no point having a house if you can't you can get to it. So. Just gonna have a bit up here. Just going right up to the door. Right up to the door there. Okay. And then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna add just the idea of kind of a field here for you and your kids to enjoy and play on. So there we go. We're just gonna add a little bit of a field there. Just to give the idea. And then we're gonna add some. We're gonna add just some, just some plants around the pond. There we go. And you can see the way the colors blend together, and that's okay. This is your picture. It's, it's your world. I'm just gonna add another little, another little, another little tree trunk there and there, and that gives the idea that there's more trees than there are. Go back to our two inch blue brush and just, just put in some sky. There we go. Adding some, some finishing, finishing touches there. Maybe just a little bit more, a little bit more green. And you know what? I think you've got yourselves a picture right there. That's your dream house in the world. So thank you very much for welcoming in your homes and I. Hope you got your paints out too. And you too can have a go with this easy technique of painting and enjoying. Now, I'll see you next time. The joy of painting.